And welcome back to the talking show. <laughs> it immediately starts getting loud. Okay. Are you drunk? I mean, we're right on. Now? We're we're doing an on location podcast. I feel like it's okay. There's a little extra noise. Oh yeah, I'm not worried about it. <laughs> okay. I was just thinking, like, it's funny. It's like check, check, check. And we're back. Okay, we're here. We're in New York. We're talking about <laughs> what happened tonight. Talking uh, about pizza's totally past- okay at best. Talking about yeah, live from New York. This pizza's all right. Yeah, the joke is a lot funnier. A million hours ago. <laughs> yeah, today we has were- felt like three days. <laughs> we did have a long trip because we drove in. Fools, fly, you fools. <laughs> That was get it. Yeah, yeah, I get it. That was a reference from earlier. Yeah, and we uh, have a extra person on the podcast today. Say hello, Devin. Hello, Devin. Damn it. Oh, we're sharing Damn. a mic, so sorry if that's annoying. They're gonna have to learn to deal. Oh my god. We're what? Gonna, These neighbors are pissed. We're recording a podcast right now. Yeah, we we're are recording doors. on location in New York in a hotel room. So I there's hate that holding the microphone. <laughs> <laughs> I kind of dig it. Yeah, I was gonna say it's. Just wait, are we doing this for? I feel an like hour? we're doing karaoke. You're also resting your arm on a bed. Like I'm. Well, you can lay down. I'm resting mine on my leg. Put you guys, you, you you guys do have a lot yeah, more cable go. to work with than here. Have you're a uh, have a pillow. It's not gonna work. There you go. Make it work. Put it under your arm. Hey. But like, between <laughs> you and Mike. Do you want to switch spots? You want the chair? No. Like, just just there you go. go. That's what I want to do. <laughs> you guys should just take off tonight. Fuck it. Yeah. yeah dude, right. That would totally. We would make it home totally. <laughs> Yeah, no, we wouldn't. <laughs> We'd be dead. But yeah, so we're in New York. A lot of us. Oh, wait, all of us for the first time? No, not Devin. No, it's my third time. Show off. Third time. No it's my first time being inside of New York. They've seen have. it before. Well, from, from Canada. Oh yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh right on. Okay. I don't mean like on TV. Hey, to our ocean conversation, it's the first time I've technically visited the ocean. I mean, I didn't like stick a toe in, but I saw it, and that was pretty cool. Oh yeah, yeah. That you, was in like episode you, like, six flew or over it, yeah. Episode seven. It's a yeah. Large body of water, man. It's dude. It's super big. It's large. It's, it's pretty, super big. That was pretty crazy. There's like <laughs> freighters on it and shit. Yeah, that was wild, man. It was wild. And then there's like <laughs> so some wild. tall ass buildings here. Yeah, New I York's flew pretty by cool. On my it's... first plane ride ever. That was pretty cool. Yeah, that was your first plane ride. Yeah. How did it feel? It felt pretty good, dude. I got I got kind of sick to my stomach. Yeah. And you didn't have any me- major delays either. No, no, no. We flew around the loops for a minute, but that was it. I'm down. We still got in here early, right? Mm, yeah. Guess I should. <laughs> That's cool. It's always faster going west to east because you're following with the jet stream. It's where the it's where the don't believe that. the wind blows. Is that true? It is. What about Earth rotation? I think that plays a part in it too. Yeah. Doesn't Earth's rotation play a part in it too? No, it's it's it's. Can no. you do me a favor? What? And can you not you fuck off? What What do you need from me, Dave? I don't need What's anything that? from you. Um, text me the second that you get to your house tomorrow. Why? I just want to know for reference, like where we're going to be <laughs> okay. compared to yeah. where you're at. No problem, man. What time does your plane actually take off? We don't know. It's like one to one thirty at some, you know, oh wait, we have it on your itinerary. One th- one thirty one. I'm going to guess we'll be going to be, we're going to be probably maybe, maybe half <laughs> To three quarters of the way you. through Pennsylvania, when by the yeah, time you actually make it home, I don't, yeah, I don't we're gonna be. You. <laughs> I'm just being Jordan right now, dude. Six we're gonna hours. make it home in six hours. <laughs> no, five because we'll gain an hour. If Mike's driving, <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! If I don't god. get pulled over. Oh my god! <laughs> tell wait, yeah. Tell yeah. Him about that. Yeah, because I try to make good time. You know, as a you know a good traveler would, trying to make good time. I speed like a son of a bitch. And um, oh my god, there's sirens. It's ruining the entire yeah, podcast. And I was going sixteen. To New York. <laughs> I was going 16 over already on the highway. 16 over? Yeah. Jesus. And I got pulled over. It looks really funny because you're moving them. <laughs> 16 over? Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. And I got pulled over, as anyone would, going 16 miles over the <laughs> speed limit for, like, give or take 400 miles. And, yeah, that sucks. <coughs> but at least uh, the cop was cool. He knocked it down to 10 miles over. Yeah, he was the homie. Because if it was 16 over, it was over the 15 mile per hour cap or whatever, Dude. which meant I would have had to appear in court in Indiana. That would have been literally That the would have been like worst. the worst thing ever for anything ever. Did you show a little cleavage? Well, a no. A little leg? 
I don't have cleavage. Oh. So you're just being nice? Yeah. Well, you told him about the story about what you were going to do, right? Yeah, I told yeah, him that we were... Uh, definitely the cause. I told him that we were cancer survivors, and we were on our way to a uh, oh, Jesus, man. to gotta... a convention in New York for a bunch like, of other cancer survivors. It's just so fucked up, because one of us will get... At least one of us is going to get cancer someday. <laughs> uh, the, Probably the one who smokes the most. Yeah. I, I mean, fucking smoke. <laughs> if two... Wait, how many people get cancer in general? What do you mean, someday? One in three? Yeah. Sure. Is it one in three people Devin get, the get cancer at all? <laughs> <laughs> plus, plus... We are we're overweight. Yeah, I'm we're, just saying that leads to the things. healthiest that bunch leads of to bros. Pretty much everything possible. Right. I can't think of like one. Guys, we're just all gonna. I don't think any of us are gonna make together. it into our 80s. No, let's go out together. We, none of us are. Gonna, we went out yeah, together we, tonight. We, what else do you want? <laughs> yeah, we went out, dude. We walked so much today. We were out on the town. He didn't mean that. I mean, I was just joking. My feet hurt. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we left. We left Rockford, Illinois, at at like 6:30 p.m. Yesterday. And we and we showed up at the hotel at eleven o'clock the next day in the morning. And and damn. the best thing Don't about say. showing up at the hotel is it was the wrong yeah, damn it. hotel because yeah. some motherfucker gives the gives us the wrong address. Yeah, so bit. technically, in, in total, it probably was a an eighteen hour trip. Yeah, I'm expecting twenty tomorrow. Oh yeah. Also, I drove the wrong direction for like eighty miles. But again, you know that's getting off topic. I was speeding, so it was you, hardly you noticed. You were supposed to be driving in the first place. I thought I thought it was all going to be Jordan. Yeah, I kind of just started driving and I didn't stop for a while. I, I, I think after I got pulled over, I was like, I need to stop driving. <laughs> no, no, no. It <laughs> Two was hours like, after. Yeah, no, it was like three hours after. You were like, all right. Well, I kept it going until the next. Did you do up. the speed limit after the ticket for for a while? And then he kept fucking <laughs> hovering. He was like hovering over eighty again. And he's like, oh, whoa, I need to. Yeah, you're having fun with your rental car. Yeah. Everyone does Would, it. Car nice. Oh yeah, what'd you guys get? Chevy Cruze 15. Yeah, it's a Chevy Cruze. Is it spelled? Is it spelled C U C R U Z? Yeah, C R U Z. Oh, just Z. No, I e. thought I had an E at the end. Mm -mm. That's Cruz. It's not even how you spell Cruz. Yeah, you should. There's no Z. Unless it's like the long U or <laughs> oh, something. There's no, there's no Z. No, there's no Z. There's no E. There's no E. No, it's not Tom Cruise. Cruise is like a word. For cars, you do like you. It's a name cars. though. Mm -hmm. It's a Chris. name for a car though. It's a silly name for a car. Yeah, yeah. So is uh, who are you to judge? PT Cruiser. Yeah, PT Cruiser. But cruise, they spell Cruiser correctly. That's right. It is a Cruiser at that point. With NPT. A... Part time Cruiser. Yeah. Is that what the PT stands for? Oh yeah, because you're not cruising all the time. Part time Cruiser. Shut up! You're lying. No, that's 100 percent accurate. No, it's not. <laughs> Google I love PT Cruisers. <laughs> Not. They, no one has ever loved. Right, they're really. awful cars, but <laughs> they look dope as hell. So, uh, especially get some flames on it. Throw some yes, flames on a purple yes. one. Or the wood paneling. Yes. Oh, I have seen the wood paneling one. Have you? Yes. Cool. So can you just stop? <laughs> Sorry. Can you stop making a point to move the microphone to her face. I got one hour of sleep in the past thirty-six hours. Wait, <laughs> yeah. You want a fucking trophy? Yeah. Can you? I mean, <laughs> yeah. We nice. didn't win one tonight. Spoilers. Damn. Spoilers. We didn't win one. No, that does kind of suck, man. I'm sorry. Yeah, it was fun. I'm having fun mm. right now. It's your choice. Yeah. If you cannot tell by my voice, which is probably a lot different. Are you sleeping in the bed or on the floor? On the floor. Why? Like your sweatpants. Because I'm sleeping Thanks, in the buddy. bed. You see him? And I'm sleeping in the yeah. bed, but we can fit a third man. No, we certainly cannot. I got these in boot yeah, camp. Third man, whatever. No, they're comfortable. It'll work. No, no. guys, he's fine with sleeping no. on the floor. Third. All right. Like all right. he he elected to. Yeah. Right, you elected to sleep on the floor, right? I elected. Did you not want to sleep on the floor? I don't care. I, I just want to Who sleep. Who wants to sleep on the floor? <laughs> you want to sleep like right now? It's like dry, it's like I wanting mean, to ride the in your mic. <laughs> <laughs> you could do this. It'd be really difficult to sleep with a conversation going on. <laughs> no, you were the guy on stage at the show. We're going to need you for that. Oh, yeah. That was a lot less stressful than what I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be like called up once, one at a time. Why did you leave during our film? He had, <laughs> I, he had to go piss. I think he thought there was t two more in between. I don't believe you. Yeah. yeah, I didn't know. I didn't know there was only one more. How did it sound? Like how? Did, I you obviously caught, came back while the film was playing, but you didn't enter the theater. I only caught the the part where I actually showed up at the house with when oh, like okay. watering. And I heard a bunch of the laughs. I'm like, that's good. That's good. Yeah, dude, there was laughs in all the right places. Mm -hmm. That's good. And it was it was the right number of laughs too. It wasn't like a how did they uh, theater 12. explosion? How did they take the sex? Oh, they liked it. They, yeah, they yeah. loved it. Oh, yeah. they, they dug the sweaty line. That sweaty mm -hmm. line works. It was so good. That's good. <laughs> and again, the line that I didn't think was too funny when we first put it in, the cookie moment, kills. 
the cookie I mean, line it, kills. I think it only kills because they all yeah, had to yeah. do it. it, it like, they're yeah. all looking where we're, where everyone's putting their certain... I don't think some uh, random person's going to be like, oh, that's so yeah. funny. I do remember Kyle mentioning, though, that like some of the people that you no, showed it to liked the cookie that's line. That's true. They did. Believe they it. liked the cookie. They thought it was so random. I don't believe anything tonight. <laughs> that we, so we, you don't believe that we lost? You believe well, I mean, we won. We won so. <laughs> <laughs> really? Guys, we did win, right? Yeah. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> we're all we winners. We're all winners. <laughs> Most of the or are we a bunch of losers for spending a bunch of money to go to this thing and yeah, and driving thing? goddamn eighteen hours? No, we got we got. We got I some mean, stuff I didn't. I mean, that was just an excuse to come here. That's not the reason that I. Yeah, mm. yeah. The real reason you came here was to eat the pizza. Eat the pizza, and it was not. It was all right. Yeah, <laughs> I don't know. The the first, first, do what you said you were place. gonna do, and the first oh, that first slice, one you had looked like it was kind of weak. The first slice literally tasted like Sbarro, which yeah. is fine. I like Sbarro, but what's up with all these East Coasters talking their shit? When they know the Midwest reigns supreme. Yeah, when you can get a good slice of New York style pizza at Sabaro. <laughs> yeah, dude. I love Sabaro. Don't get me wrong. Gotta stop at an Oasis, get some Sabaro. Right it on. wasn't was, anything special to me. It was pizza. But then again, I didn't have the whole. I don't glorify the Midwest pizza either. Pizza. It's all I did pizza like that, uh, uh, that the second pizza that I had, the one with the tomatoes and the mozzarella. The mozzarella. <laughs> that, that, that looks good. good. That looks good. The Caprizi pizza. Yeah, the Caprizi. Didn't you have yeah. one of those too, Devin? A mozzarella tomato. Yep. Sick. <laughs> Tight. Uh, the second pizza place we went to was better. It still was okay, though. What was that called? I don't fucking know. Ray's Original? It was yeah. Ray's Famous. Somebody's original fucking one. name. They're all Ray's Original. Famous Ray's Original. I don't know. Every single Ray's. There's like, how many are there in New York? There's like... 27. Yeah, like 27. And they all say that they're the original you have Ray's. No idea. But are they all famous? They're all famous and they're all the original one. But they're not all under the same company? No, yeah, no, they're not you know, owned by the same people. How does that they're work? They're not? No. That's the whole thing. That each one claims that they're the original, and there's no way to oh, prove it was I get the original. I, I didn't understand what you That's were talking hilarious. about See, I just thought it was a chain, and they just, yeah. just, no. just to stand out, I thought they all... Isn't there, like, a copyright infringement thing going on? Yeah, probably like no. somebody's like, no one just No one cares. Yeah, no we one also cares found an Uncle Nick's here. <laughs> yeah, there's an Uncle Nick's here. And it serves Greek food, too. I'm sure so it tastes it exactly zeros. the same. I'm going to open a coffee shop called Starbucks. Two words. You would get sued. Yeah, yeah that's, oh, that's damn, totally. Really? Yeah. You, yeah. yeah. They got some money. Starbucks with a Z. Again, they have the money. They Starbucks. So I would just never, because I couldn't afford the lawyers. Thing with any, with the word Star or Bucks you could probably do know. like Kyle Bucks. Ooh. It has no ring to it, though. I don't know why you. <laughs> Call it like moon money. You know, because it's Starbucks. Moon dollars. Like moon. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> or you could just like Kyle's coffee. <laughs> Kyle's coffee, both K's. Do, do you even like? Do you even like coffee? Kyle's coffee corner? I like. I like some iced coffee. <laughs> you like what? I like Come coffee. get a hot cup of the cake. I don't like hot. I don't like hot drinks, man. Yeah, I, me either. Except for coffee, they're not relaxing. They're, they're the very you don't like relaxing. Hot, hot? You don't yeah. like hot chocolate? How do you not like hot chocolate? I wouldn't oh, say. I do, I do I like hot chocolate. What I is wouldn't. more relaxing than tea? I fucking hate tea. I, don't know. I, think it I wouldn't like say a green tea either, but it's like a relaxing. Well, yeah, I guess I can agree. They literally make tea that is supposed to like relax you so you can yeah. go to bed so they don't make shakes to do that tea. it doesn't have a better name than that no it's called sleepy time tea she also has she... tummy tamer tea this is gonna be awful to edit i'm sorry yeah. mike well th this is it's this, gonna be fine it's all this good. is an episode that's taking place in new york if people don't like the audio issues i mean like we're doing this in a hotel room in new york yeah, with handheld bitch. mics this is also our 25th it. episode that's yeah, right yeah. Yeah. number 25 boo, 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 shut boo, the fuck boo, up boo, boo, boo. don't do yeah. that because mike's Mike plugged his phone into oh the car. Oh my god, yeah. Every Mike, time I plugged my phone into the car to charge it, it at some point I recorded a ringtone on my phone of me going boo 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 or something I like that for like that. Well, I recorded it back sometime when I first got my phone for a ringtone, but I never used it as a ringtone. But it's like the only thing I have recorded audio on my phone. Like mm -hmm. I've never recorded any other audio. So when I plugged my phone into the car to charge it, every time I did that it shut off all the radio stations <laughs> and immediately started playing that on loop. <laughs> We did, yeah, and Steak and Shake, it did it. And, <laughs> and, and it's funny because we'd be like, what the fuck is this? What's that? going on? It's like, boom, 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 boom. And, and we would switch it off and replay tight. it. Ohio. I don't know why the fuck we didn't get food That's at Sheets. Who? It's like the only reason to the, go to Ohio. It, it looked like gas station food. Yeah, but it's not. They make it. It didn't look like anyone was working there. We you, can get it on the way back. You go to a fucking the menu you thing. order it. Yeah, you fucking. That's tight. You type it in, and you're like, I want this and this and this, and then they make it. 
Well, we went to Steak and Shake. It said, you know, a thing that we can get at home. Yeah, I guess you I didn't know real. Sheets was a thing at I all, so I was just thinking it was a gas though. station. You get a do-over on your way back. I, yeah, yeah. I, probably, I probably, I don't want so to. You only speak when yeah. I'm in front of you. I just want to straight, straight through. I'm going to speak whenever I feel like it, and then you can put the mic in front of my face while I'm speaking. I don't, I won't eat anything tomorrow. I choose to not put the mic in front of you at all. Because I just want to keep driving. Yeah, but I mean, we have to stop at some point. Yeah, so just get gas and go. sounds funny. I wish we could hear a food. You can get a if food. If you guys want to listen to it, so what's the point of you not getting <laughs> just Devin and I do? I'm just going to sit in the car. <laughs> yes. This guy's a fucking psychopath. Ready to go. It's, this guy's it's a psychopath. I'm not even Big paying attention. Podcast. You can just search Big Brother Podcast. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hey, Kyle, we're fucking... trying to have a podcast over here. <laughs> it's cool. That all gets cut out. So it's fine. <laughs> Your fucking shitty Big Brother Podcast. Look at this. Look at him. He was so disappointed. No, it's not. podcast. Yeah, during whatever conversation you guys were having. Speaking of Big Brother. It wasn't uh, the Big Brother thing that annoyed me. It was you going like this. Like, Oh, that was for like two seconds. Shut up. Yeah, what? shut up, pussy. Nothing. Uh, you think uh, they're going to go after Johnny Mac right away? No. Do you want to know who they're putting up? Yes. They put up uh, James and Meg. Good. They don't Fuck care which one I don't like them. I don't like either of them. But dude, here's the thing, though, man. <sighs> It's Vanessa's turn to make a move in this. Hey, remember house. Doctor Who? Like it's she happening could, again. She could have literally gone after. I'm all right with it. The threesome of Austin, uh, Liz, and Julia, Someone with with the help of Steve, James, and or Steve and uh, Johnny Mac, plus maybe Meg and James. Here's what I said. I said you should have gone to Meg and James and said, Hey, listen, this week we're gonna team up, and I'm gonna get fucking one of these threesomes out of the house, or one of these three out of all the right, house. So, anyways, and then, I think- and then next week. Just if you guys win, don't put us up. And that's the one fucking rule. So we'll bond for these two weeks, and then we're going our separate ways. I think Meg is really unattractive. Thank you. <laughs> she's, like, not... Is that train face? annoying. I think that her face... I think she has, like, a cute face, but is I think that she has the face? body of, like, a 10-year-old boy. <laughs> and is train face gone? Okay. Train face is gone. Mm-hmm. That's all I remember Speaking was train of sucks. attractive and unattractive, there's a lot of attractive girls in New York. Yeah, just like yeah. every other big city. Just like everywhere, pretty well, like, much. But like all of them like look like supermodels for some reason. <laughs> Do you think they know we don't live here? Oh, yeah, yeah definitely. Because yes. yeah. we're so yeah, unattractive. Everyone in New York knows we're tourists. Well, I mean, most of the people we saw today were tourists. They were like European tourists, is what it sounded like. I That's feel like true. I saw like two people that are from New York today. <laughs> I've seen today. like 3,000 yeah. Asians in the last 30 hours. The fuck does that have to do with anything? What's wrong with that? A lot of traveling. Oh, yeah? yeah. Is, that, is that what that is? I thought we were Asians talking about Eastern European people. I've also I mean, seen a lot of Asians. It's not part of Europe. Yeah. No, I know. Also just it's connected to Europe, but it's not. It's a whole separate yeah. continent. But all Asians What are, are we tourists? talking about anymore? No, I'm not saying they're all tourists. Yeah, I'm just saying I saw a lot. You know what? If I edit it out. I like how you, like, immediately, like, once you started smelling the smoke, you, like, immediately started taking apart your it vaporizer. It makes sense, though. Well, yeah, no, it's because no. they fucking explode. And <laughs> I'm not having that shit explode in my face. <laughs> And then Dave yeah. today, I was starting to talk in a New York accent, and Dave started getting angry with me. This is, like, like fucking rude, oh man. Oh, my God. Like, it's not. Jordan can't what let this go. What were things you were saying? I'm just... He I wasn't know, saying I was, anything I wasn't mean, saying, like, anything, like, mean like, or demeaning to, like, New Yorkers or anything. I was just like, hey, what's up, Dave? What are you doing? He was just, he was just <laughs> mocking <laughs> their accent. And just, like, if they... If New Yorkers were to come to Chicago and mock our accent... Yeah. Well, also, like, so it's, like, you're a different person than here. I think so. Oh, so it's rude because it's here. But I if just you were think like, you're just like walking around being a tourist, yeah. going like. I guarantee you, not hey, every hey, New Yorker would be insulted by that. But it's like, why do something that could insult someone, anyways? Who cares? That's you my point. You just don't want to. You just don't. It's wanna not like I'm gonna ruin their like life or their or even their day, just because I'm walking around like having fun myself. No, but it just like feeds and like this is why we hate tourists. Tourists are the worst. Well, they hate tourists regardless. Because they walk around making fun of their accents. No, yeah. they don't. Dickweed. <laughs> Or they go and get really drunk and, you know. I wonder how much noise this chord's going to make. So should we t- let's talk about, th- about the actual event tonight. Yeah, it was tight. It was fun. Drunk Canadian right, girls. So we, we found out we are playing fifth to last, right? Yeah, and we got excited because that's, that's, usually, cool. that's usually a good place is near the end, right? Yeah, for sure. Oh, for sure. I would think so. And then, but then I noticed when w- we got about halfway through, maybe a little bit more than half, it seemed like they really crowded the front with some good stuff. Yeah, they really crowded the front with some good stuff, and then like a lot of just not so good stuff in the middle and the, towards the end. Yeah, there was there was a lot of high production value stuff that looked really good, but then yeah, there were a lot of stinkers too. I feel like it was half and half in my <coughs> opinion. Ten to twelve good, ten to twelve bad, and then we were in the middle somewhere. That's my opinion on it. I think we were one of the best. That's not just because we made it. It's just because like I like shit that's our style. 
So yeah, I I would have to agree. <laughs> Check it out. Not because be we're gonna post it back onto yeah. the talk. Like high high, high yeah, production value doesn't again. fucking matter to me. A lot of the For ones the that had part. high production value, like the stories, didn't make yeah, sense. Yeah, as fuck. Yeah, yeah, a lot of artsy fartsy type stuff that was just weird, and a lot of them were winning, like in the top five, and they were just so unexciting and uninteresting to watch it was like a trailer for another movie yeah it wasn't an actual like full complete thing on its own yeah but at the same time i don't know i don't know how complete ours is it's i mean it's, com- it's, com- in the end. it's complete Wait, but s- speaking of that real quick i do want to mention that there were certain criteria with this movie like it couldn't be over three minutes and 30 seconds and then with credits like with a credit se- like sequence couldn't be over four minutes so we were like, I feel like one of few that actually were under there a lot of time. I don't know why you're so bent out of shape about it though, because like even if the the t- I, I don't know, I feel like we would have made it as short as possible regardless. Well, yeah, no, I have no problem with that. My problem is, and I know we don't, they, these guys only have 24 hours to edit, but they have 24 hours to edit and like leave a bunch of garbage in when they could tighten things up, and like one hit the criteria. And two, make a better movie. Yeah. I don't so really. then what about the movies that were a little bit longer but turned out good, in your opinion? I can't think of one. I, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, we got a sheet of them. We could run through them real quick. <laughs> just, like, each of us give a one-word <coughs> review type deal. I think bad, if we're talking bad, about ones bad. that were longer that I liked, I think that Seven Days Till Death was longer than three minutes. Yeah. Yeah, that was the first one where I really felt... Well, no, actually, the first one is definitely longer than the allotted Hacked. time. Yeah. But that what, second one I noticed, I was like, wow, is this going to be a regular trend? Being like Actually, long I want to back up. I just said that they were all. That a lot of them were bad. I don't want to talk shit. I just like ours better. <laughs> just, the other that stuff was a just, really good. The other stuff is just not my style. Mm-hmm. Just put it that way. Yeah, and when I say they're good or bad, that's just you know that's just me talking. You know what I'm really tired of seeing, and I, we kind of suffer Tall through it buildings, too. Tall buildings, man. Me too. But uh, <laughs> you know, I love boners. Tax. But uh, <laughs> we all know tax uh, audio issues. I feel like I just yeah, with my job of- and everything else, like I just. Everybody has audio which No one cares about fucking audio. You know what I was thinking? Like, a lot of this reminded me of, like, your, the student films from your work, but, like, without those audio issues. No. Fair enough. Actually, a lot of this, yeah, a lot of this felt like student films. I'm not going to say ours didn't. I'm just saying, like, it definitely it felt like in that area, like, rather than, like, a film festival. Yeah. No, for sure. I mean, 24 hours is the remarkable thing here. Everybody needs to keep that in mind. But. Yeah. It, a lot of, if these did keep to the 24 hour then every single one of them did something pretty impressive for being 24 hours. Like, whether that was superimposing text messages onto the screen or having a original score yeah. or shooting on oh, 11 yeah, different locations. I don't care how good or bad it is at that point. That's fucking amazing that you're able to well, get all that I done mean, the, in, in that 24 hours. Stuff would be really easy. But your, your point still stands. I guess maybe stands. to me it's amazing. Your point I'm, still stands. Yeah. I mean, all you gotta do is bring that stuff into Photoshop and take mm-hmm. take care of the background. And then plop, there was an animated feature. Literally plop it on. I like the animated feature because it it came like perfectly. Because after a while, I was like, uh, and then it was just like it was it was like a breath of fresh air. It was like, ah, oh, thank you. Just to be clear, they mean an animated short. What? You said animated feature. Yeah, Whatever. I just want to make sure that they oh, featured yeah. an like, anime. Yeah, which actually was really like yeah, you're right. That was really short. cool. A breath of fresh air. I know you said it might not have been like as. Yeah, I wasn't as, as impressed be, by but it. For 20, yeah. I, don't, I don't know. Who knows what their experience level is? They might have been super mm-hmm. lacking, and maybe that's, like, impressive yeah. for, for them. Or or if they, like, started with just a blank sheet and went from there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's sure. like a lot of it looked like it, it was just copy and pasted stuff that could have been... If, yeah, they just had, if they just had, like, a wolf or a sheep or a cookie thing <laughs> already drawn in their program, they just load it in and get it done. Yeah. They should have won Best Animated Short. But there wasn't a category. Jordan's you know? sick. Imagine, maybe it's the everybody. first time someone submitted something, you know? I feel like I'm gonna get no, sick. No, they've, they've had animated in the past. Oh, okay. Because of New York? Yeah. Nah, just because of lack of sleep and shit. Yeah. I'm worn down. What's up? Oh, you don't feel good? I mean, I feel fine right now. But you just feel I, just, like... I just feel like I'm going to get sick. Yeah, that, that's something I'm worried about, too, is because, you know, long hours and, and little sleep, you're gonna not feel that great from it. Mm. But yeah, anything else you guys want to talk about as far as, like, the films played? Um, is there a place we can direct the audience to to watch them? I Google. guess I could com. send them to... They can go public again, right? Well, I, uh, yeah, I could send them to 24 Hour Film Racing and they could see the list of them there and I guess under their own free will search them up that way. Just, sure. put, yeah. just put 24 Hour yeah, the Film Race hour in film the race. show notes. Yeah, I'll do that. One thing that worries me that I, did, I, mean, I didn't really think about because I never thought we had to worry about it, but someone mentioned today having a director's cut 
So clearly they're trying to take this 24-hour film and make a better short film out of it. Yeah, and Dave was just... But it's just like, it should be what it is. Yeah, that's I've said that, I said that on like two podcasts ago. We were talking, I don't know if you were in the, you must have been gone. They, he brought up like people didn't want to post their Mopix shit or whatever. They wanted oh, to work on yeah, it yeah, longer yeah. or whatever. And it's just stupid. Oh, Once yeah. it has a first fucking public screening, it should just be done. Yeah. Unless it's literally like a test screening. Yeah. To get like sure. reactions. I mean, like I was, but especially with something like this, like just ki- like. The whole point is that it was like 20, <coughs> done in 24 yeah. hours. So what, what were you guys' personal favorite and personal worst? Uh, my personal favorite yeah. was Into the Night. Ours. <laughs> Into yeah, the Night. Probably. Yeah. I'm not just, like, I'm not even trying to be an asshole. It's just, like, that's our style and that's the shit I'm into. What have you had to okay, pick Okay, okay, okay. Second, ours? second. Okay, one that wasn't ours was the fucking two Canadian guys. Oh, yeah, I like that one. For sure. Oh, yeah, the uh, Chilling Intrusion. <laughs> yeah, that one Chill good. Intrusion. Two guys in a pool and they're just hanging out in there and they see the guy in the window. That was pretty yeah, funny. Yeah, it was dope. I have to say my probably my one of my favorites as far as like humor was Seven Days Till Death about uh, the guy who finds out he's gonna die in seven days and then the Grim Reaper shows up and starts to, and moves in with him. Yeah, like basically I thought like that was just a really cool premise. Mm-hmm. Um, it had some them. really funny jokes in it too. Like when he shows up early, <coughs> like he he just runs straight home from the grocery store or something, and he like comes in on the Green Reaper. Ra- ra- I was gonna, Green Reaper, the Grim the Green Reaper, Reaper. <laughs> Green the Reaper, the Green Reaper. He walks in on the Grim r- Reaper. <laughs> the Grim Reaper just slams the laptop closed and like knocks the lotion <laughs> off the table. That was so good. That was kind of gold. Uh, one of my least favorite. I don't. You, you know what? There were just some bad ones. Yeah. Like, what are you gonna do? I don't want to point one out. Yeah, I, I realized right after I said it, I shouldn't have said yeah. it. Yeah. Uh, what about you, Devin? The favorites? End of the night. Into the night. Uh, Why is that your favorite? Actually, the title is really awful, though. That's yeah, one thing. Yeah, the title sucks. Title yeah. is like really terrible. Whoever came up with that should kill themselves. You know what? I came up with Jesus. that because no one had anything better. That I, I, he has a fair point. Like that is the that reason w- it got picked. That I was is not the best forward. option that we had. We were throwing around ideas. Yeah, they were awful. all they were all bad. <laughs> yeah, but we, we were, were all worse. We weren't done throwing around ideas. You're just like into the night. That's we it. We had to title it. Yeah, we, we had, fucking it, had to send it, it in. It was a 24 hour film race. <laughs> There was no discussion, though. I mean, like, we were done filming everything, and we all went home. We're like, we'll edit it tomorrow. I posted in the group. I yeah, was no, like, there was a discussion. Was there? Yeah, yeah. Right before we officially sent it in, yeah, because, like, we posted all the ideas, obviously, and then I was like, you guys got to pick something. And then I don't remember being part of this discussion at all. Tonight. I wasn't either. Yeah. I wasn't either. Can we repeat it? I don't know why you're putting it on my face after I'm done talking. <laughs> <laughs> well, you got to let me know when you're going to talk. When I start talking. That's when I'm going to talk. <laughs> I smell feet. Yeah, there's a lot of exposed feet right now. It's my feet. Was there seriously a discussion about this, though? I don't even remember. Yeah, it. Was, was I part of it? Yeah, I didn't just make the call, man. <laughs> because I just remember posting in the group, we don't have a title, and then I remember us all coming up with some titles, and then I remember going to bed after that. And then the next morning, I was like, so, what was? did we decide on a title? What are we going to do? And then it was like, no, we went with the, into the night. And I was like, oh, okay. Oh, maybe we did. And I had no uh, idea. Maybe it's just a conversation between you and I, actually, because you had to make the title. Yeah, I had to finish the edit before like, we did the... Yeah. Before we sent it off to sound, That's yeah. True. Whatever. Get mad about it. It's over. It's officially over with. Yeah, actually. yeah. I'm, I'm, I just... So, you know, oh, no, I'm not Don't blame it on me. Like, I just realized... Let's go down. Let's, like go, let's, let's go down. Let's go down there real quick. We want to change the title. Oh, wait. I think we're at... <laughs> oh, yeah. Director's cut. Changing the title. <laughs> let's change it to... What was the one that won? <laughs> yeah, let's, let's change the title. Uh, change dimes? dimes. Yeah, Dimes, but in French. There you go. Uh, dimes No, wait. Why did you like Into the Night? Because we made a... That's shitty, really biased. That's that is as biased. That, that is the most biased response. You because my opinion. How because, is my opinion not going to be biased? <laughs> you can't answer someone's opinion. <laughs> like, that's a bias. Yeah. Dumbass. I like it because I think it's funny. <laughs> and I made it with I'll, my friends. I like it because I think yeah. it's funny. And we finished before 4 a.m., which was key. That, that was, was really cool, yeah. And uh, it didn't suck. All right. Um, I <laughs> didn't think Into the Night was the best one. <laughs> <laughs> well, your opinion's yeah, wrong, and you're, 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 you're fuck off. See you next year. Not. Was the best. Yeah. You said which one did I like the best? Oh, which one was the best? Oh, the one that won. That's f- dimes. Yeah, I like that one a lot. Like I, production could have been better. I liked the idea of it a lot, but it just like kind of looked crappy aesthetically. Twenty four hours, man. No, I know. I agree. And I, it literally kind of feels like they just did it, just like we did. Yeah. Like yeah. you know what I mean? They just kind of fucking just did it. Mm-hmm. And that's what's kind. Of, that's what's rad. The like, thing I didn't like about times camcorder. is I felt like it was just two people talking the whole time. Yeah, and I'm not that into that's that kind style. of thing. Yeah. I, I know it's like, and I 
I like it when it's something funny or something like that because it's kind of comedy routiney and I kind of get into that because I like stand up. I mean, it ended on a joke. Yeah, yeah, it was. It had its humorous yeah. elements, but I mean, like the it was. Cunt. Yeah, a child. Yeah. A child saying cunt. I in mean, French. we don't even know, did she say it? That's yeah. true. <coughs> she probably did. Cunt probably, probably means nothing like in French. reciting the French Pledge of Allegiance. We don't know. Uh, I really liked belligerent Canadian lady in audience. She's just, oh, oh, God, oh, a yeah. riot. Um, yeah. What? <laughs> yeah, stop was, it. Stop like, it. Right now. You know what? You'll honestly pick up on this mic, so it's fine. It was funny because she, she won an award. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and she goes on stage. So she's like, I don't have anything to say, and then spent like 20 minutes on the stage dancing. <laughs> God. Oh, it was like, great. She was laughing at every like, joke. There's higher alcohol content in Canadian like beer, but like that lady was just gone in America. Mm -hmm. <laughs> like, I don't know. Maybe she's she on other things. Open bar had. Oh yeah, and when the That's FAQ true. was going on, she was like, and she answered your question, and then she just kept going, even when they. She was like, no, 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 you questions. don't get it. You don't get. It. I want. I want you riding to that me. wave. What was that wave? <laughs> Did you feel that wave? And they're all like, they're like yeah. Well, like, okay. Okay. She's like, no, show of hands. Who felt that wave? <laughs> they like coffee. <laughs> Who had coffee? I'm pretty sure all of you. Yeah. We didn't have any fucking coffee. That's all you no. want. Oh wait, Dave. Dave probably had some coffee. In Friday. I mean, night. like, like in the morning. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah, like yeah. a normal person. Although well, we did it doesn't kinda... work for me like that. Damn. Like it it work it doesn't do it do, it's just a part of my morning. It's not like gotcha. I can't if I'm like really tired I can't like have a strong cup of coffee and then it wakes me up I'm still tired. Would you be more doesn't... tired if you didn't have a cup of coffee though? In the morning, Bless yeah, you. but not at night. Gotcha. At night yeah. it doesn't matter. I tried to go one morning without having coffee. I was like, "Oh, I think like I don't need coffee that much." And I went one morning and I was like, "This is the worst day." Of I mean, my I life. could do it she because I so drink grumpy. I drink a lot of like I drink a lot of diet coke. So it doesn't matter really. I, yeah. I'm like jacked on caffeine regardless. Gotcha. But uh, like drinking a big cup of coffee in the middle of the night does. I guess like it being hot. Like say I was in his shoes last night and I had to dry, start driving at three in the morning or whatever the fuck. I'd probably get a big hot cup of coffee, but I don't. I don't think it would be the caffeine that fucking jacked me. Gotcha. It'd be like the hot. <laughs> the hot. You got that James Dean daydream look in your eye, and I got. That I'd one. say my personal favorite <laughs> of uh, all the movies was Peter. Peter. Uh, I liked that one a lot, even like more than it just the sweet. gag at the end. And, uh, yeah. Like the gag at the end is the thing I probably laughed the hardest at all night. The, the Everyone boner likes joke. the inner monologue. I didn't like but, the gag. I, liked I didn't like the inner monologue, like the actually. You didn't? Yeah. When he stood up and had a boner, I was like, oh. Yeah. But, then, but then, yeah, it came back, though. Yeah. Like, because of the, you, oh, yeah, you when the guy, the ridiculousness When of the it, guy backs out. Yeah. Nice boner. Nice, like, that, nice that, that, was the, that was the punchline to the whole thing. And I just like how actually, long he was standing it. up. I know. That, it's that's like, what I liked about it. It kept it. That, it was, I liked it. <laughs> someone should have asked. Were they? Oh, I don't think they were there. Someone should have asked if it was a real boner. Yeah, was that real no, dick someone or? was there. Was someone there? Someone yeah, we oh. met him. Oh, I didn't know I met him. I met him. You know what? That's a good one. I asked a fucking stupid question about the beans. Like, I should have been asking about the... The boners. Yeah, the boners. Why didn't I ask about boners? But it was funny because it had the whole inner monologue thing. I liked the bit where she was eating the cookie and he fantasizes about fucking her, like, while she's wearing an apron making cookies. Like, it was, <laughs> it was really funny to me. I liked it. I thought it was really funny. It was funny. I forgot about that one. Well, it wasn't that funny, though. Um, again, another one that was really funny, Good Daddies. Forget. That was hilarious. Oh, wait, no. That, that one's one was serious. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And when we go crashing about down, now. we come back about New York every more. time. Is there anything to talk about? I, I, I feel like, feel like New York has I just feel like, to offer. I just feel like... You just slept in a room all day. <laughs> we went to that Chelsea you were tired. Uh, Art Deli thing. You when were I walked tired around New York, I was like, this is Chicago. Cramped. Only, like, some weirder buildings. I feel, yeah, and the streets are more packed. Well, I feel and that's like it. we're in a smaller part of New York. Like, we're in a different kind of part of New York, though. We're not in typical, like, Broadway fucking... Times Square. Yeah, I don't fucking hate that. Central Park. Hey, careful! You're gonna offend Dave. We're in like the. We're in like the. The difference is he's not. He's not strutting down the street. Yeah, we're Might just. As well. We're just in a more chill, just, like laid back part of. I'm gonna fuck Manhattan. you up, dude. I guess then that might be I it. But it's like I'm just here and I'm just like this is just basically Chicago to me. I didn't feel anything special about. It. I get. You. I feel. I felt a lot of similarities to Chicago. Obviously. You, you did the. You had a good point though. The fucking sidewalks are fabulous. Yeah, here. sidewalks are great here. Except when there's a ton of trash on them, which I didn't—I thought there's was thought was like I didn't know the of validity trash. of that. But then as tonight I saw people, rolled on, there's more, I saw more people trash. like chucking trash out of their cars. Really? Yeah. People don't give a shit. Yeah. I Damn. See, like Chicago, it may be smaller, but it's definitely a lot cleaner. 
Yes, for sure. I feel like I hear that time and time again from New Yorkers. Yeah. Who like go to Chicago. They're like, we have alleys. Yeah, that was a thing too. Like it took so long to get here in the cab today because like we were going through these, you know, these streets and uh, trucks were like unloading stuff into stores, but they don't have alleys to go through. So they just have to stop in the middle of the street and unload stuff. Poorly designed guys. It's almost like it was done hundreds of years ago. Start over. Yeah, you should just just start over. Just start over. Burn it down tonight. They can start over. Jesus fucking Christ! Damn. Um, I wow. hope that didn't pick up. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure there's some vacant buildings. Just dig, just like dig them out straight through. There's an alley. Yeah. Boom. <laughs> there's alley. an alley. <laughs> Tear down some buildings. You got an alley. <laughs> and that these, what an and alley these is, blocks are a lot smaller than Chicago, mm-hmm. to be honest, too. Yeah. They're a lot smaller. Yeah. But then again, Chicago's got alleys, so it's like mm-hmm. I fucking hate Chicago, though. So yeah, which I is hate, better, I New York or Chicago? Uh, I don't. I mean, I've only been in New York for. I'm going to say New York right now because I've spent a lot of time in Chicago and I absolutely fucking hate it. So, right now, New York. All right. You hear that, New York? Give them, give them time. The I Big mean, Apple. How do you like New York, Jordan? He says he wants to live here. Yeah, he I, loves I, any I big city, here. though. I, feel, I could, I feel I could see I myself live living here. I, I, I think I, I would really enjoy it. Yeah. There's kind of, like, a lot going on. There's, there, I, t- I was telling Devin earlier. I'm sorry. There's an atmosphere. There's an atmosphere, like, that goes along with cities that I, that, that's just, yeah. that, that, uh, that I like. For sure, there's a hustle, but but also that's one thing to be like, oh, I can't. And then once you live somewhere, it's like it kind of dies. No, 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 it doesn't die down for me, because even with Los Angeles, after a while, as much as I, you know, like didn't really like getting stuck in traffic every now and then, Mm -hmm. and and there was a lot of people and everything, I still loved it. I still loved living there. Yeah, I never, I never hated living in Los Angeles. That's true. As much as I like hated the commute when we lived in Chicago, I never hated living in Chicago. Yeah. I was telling Devin earlier, I was like, this is a city where you can literally do something different every fucking day or go somewhere different every day. It sounds exhausting. But exa- but I'm a man of, I'm a creature of habit. Yeah. So it's like, that's, that's exactly it's like, that's a cool point. thing to say, but then it's like, I would never do all of that. Exactly. You're I'd be exactly like, here's my a... Chinese place. It's the only Chinese place I'll ever talk about. The same thing with Chicago. There's always something going on in Chicago and we did the same thing. We did the same <laughs> shit. Same shit. We yeah. even, sometimes okay, we different Even things, like but... people talk shit about Rockford and how there's nothing to do. There's a ton of shit to do. Not as much, but there's a ton of shit. I just never do. You it could do something every weekend. I don't do shit. Yeah. So yeah, you, do, you do what you want to do. Yeah, because that's, that's being a fucking human being. This it's is America. We get to choose. That, that's why I wouldn't like a big city either, because I'm the same way. Where I would just get up, go to work, go home, maybe go to a place on the way home to get something and hang out with the same four friends every day anyway. So it's like a big city would be wasted on me, and would only cause me grief. Where it's like I have to deal with the problems that come with a big city, like traffic or whatever. I'm I'm not a fan I because I don't is. I don't live that kind of lifestyle. I I I like them for vacations, a place to go visit and hang out and do stuff. But I could never. Also, live in uh, one. I need to be able to drive comfortably. Yeah, yeah, this is not a city to drive in. That Even Chicago, I could comfortably drive in all the yeah. time. Yeah. Here, I will. Ugh. Yeah, it's Jordan compared it to driving down a grocery aisle, which I think <laughs> works. <laughs> it's a nightmare. I wouldn't be able to do it. It's fun. You know, you know Every the uh, road is a one way. You know that uh, you know the last part of the first Star Wars movie where he finally gets into that uh, the, the, the trench, not Lord of the Rings, the, the trench. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. And the, on the Death Star, that's what yeah. it kind of felt like driving. That in. trench is huge, though. Yeah, like it fit three. Well, yeah, 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 yeah. It, it fit, yeah. <laughs> but it, like a smaller version of that, and you're just like dodging how about like, like laser beams. How it's like the like, missiles going into the the ducks or whatever. That was actually getting to the hotel. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> And the then wrong you, and, hotel. And then you found out that it was like it was like the the missiles you shot were like a dud. <laughs> you got to go back around and, yeah. because you're fucking. You got to me- loop around. Your mechanic loaded up the wrong. Oh, missiles. You got Use the force, Luke. Oh shit! Sorry. R2 Hang on. D two gave me the wrong <laughs> coordinates. <laughs> yeah. My whole um, sorry. That's to, why he turned off his targeting computer. Uh, my whole issue with that whole thing that you just said about how it was like fun and stuff is that if you make a wrong move, you could die. And or kill someone else. else. No, not in the die. not not in the city. Like on the like on the highway coming into the city. Oh well, yeah. Not in the city. You're going fucking 25 miles per oh, hour. Yeah. But, yeah, you can. Wait, why was the highway really bad? You could. Also... It wasn't that. It was like kind of fucked up when we were like getting when we had to go into the tunnel. It wasn't that bad? I mean, you could die on I-90 just leaving Rockford. Yeah, I know. You could literally die saying. right now. You know. Yeah. You know. You know That's what I'm. Embolism. I'm... Building explodes. Don't I fucking hate every single Don't one of you. Say that. I hope you all have <laughs> embolisms <terrifying>. right now. <laughs> I hope you guys die on the highway tomorrow. Jesus fucking Don't say Christ! Shit like that. I'm sorry. 
Yeah, You'll have to take the SD joking. card on the plane now because if we die in the car, <laughs> oh, this has to air. Oh man, that would be mm-hmm. depressing. I take it back. Don't include that. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, I hope you die on the plane. So now I have to take the SD Damn. card with me. No, Devin lives. Oh, okay. Actually, you're the only casualty. It's a weird plane accident. <laughs> plane like somehow crashes into you yeah like and it, you die it crashes on a lamp pole and it impales only one seat <laughs> just on a lamp pole. can you stop cackling it's just midnight do you not like when people tell you to be quiet when you're not being loud or that yeah. they want you to die yeah. is, that, is that not fun no he, just, yeah. he doesn't like that i call him out for no. cackling yeah. like a fucking middle-aged no. woman yeah. no yeah. i mean i'm agreeing with you i put that in the you're asking Twitter where I was like we cackle like middle-aged yeah, woman on tonight's does, episode uh, does anybody have any Advil? No. Yeah. <laughs> Why? What's wrong with you? You have Advil? Yeah, Dude, you, you know what you need? You don't need an Advil. You need sleep. No, I... Need... <laughs> like, literally the reason you have a headache right now is because you're awake. I'm telling you, that old lady, she was in Doctor Who. <laughs> I, I thought it was proven that it wasn't. I looked up the lady that he thought it was, and it wasn't her, but I did, like, she looked like an old lady I could have seen in Doctor Who before. I just don't know what episode, and that that show has a ton of old ladies. No, and... no, no, the, the one where she had the straw, and she, like, sucked the blood out yeah, of the people. Yeah, that we looked up that one, and that one definitely wasn't her. That was her. That was did her. you just watch this episode recently? I did. Okay. So, There's a ton of old ladies in the show. There's a ton of old ladies in, in the world. There's bound to be some that look alike. All yeah. old ladies look the same. Yeah. Yeah, I don't want to say I don't want to be racist against old ladies, but I they all look this. the same. There, I said it, and they're all named Agatha. Old lady isn't a race. <laughs> the old lady race. No one even heard that. <laughs> this, I'm getting a little. We must mm-hmm. purge the race of old ladies. <laughs> this is how I'm sleeping. That's You're sleeping in your people. shoes. I'm literally gonna sleep like like I'll probably take my hat off and I might change my shirt. You might take your hat off. Yeah, so you, there's a chance like you'll sleep with your hat. Yeah. To me, that's madness. That's, that's like scary. sleeping with shoes on. <laughs> Madness. You have to roll over. I'm not going to roll over. You don't roll over ever? I mean, if I had an he entire bed like in a to myself, I would probably roll over. Are these full size? I don't want to end up with a fucking face full oh, of Mike. I think it's a queen. Yeah, because I'll be sleeping next to him in my undies. I think it's a full. It's a full. It's Looking at him all night. It's probably queens if you just got a one. Oh, no, yeah. yeah I don't like you very much. Ooh, I know. You should have just got one. Yeah. That's actually a compliment considering actually, how much you, you hate just everything. Everything. Just take one of the beds out of the room, so that way, you know, there's a room for everyone else. What do you mean? Like, like we can all just sleep on the floor then. It'd be even. Oh my We'd God. all be equals. I didn't want to sleep on the floor. No, I'm just saying, yeah. keep one bed for you guys, because whatever. <laughs> so so oh. we're not all equals. <laughs> yeah, like, no, all the guys that drove are equals. Oh, oh. You guys see? Yeah, we have a miserable time bed. driving. Let's just sleep so we're on just the com- floor. We're just going to be comfortable the entire time, guys. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> we fly. We no, I'm in, I'm in a nice bed. beds. I'm really into O'Hare, by the way. I'm, like, really into it. What do you mean? I like it. I don't know. I'm just into it. Like, you know the movie The Terminal? The Steven Spielberg movie with Tom Hanks where he, like, lives at the airport for a while? Yeah. I thought that was George Clooney. Nope. That's You're thinking of Up in the Air. Oh. Whatever. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, like, Tom Hanks plays this, like, foreign dude who just, like, is stuck at the terminal because, like, some legal paperwork, whatever. And it's just, like, I don't know. Like, I could just see these people who's, like, this is their daily lives, like, working talk. and going around. And it's just, like the fuck out of here i was just super into it it's so I'm big just, stop I'll, it there's like everything is there it's like no you don't also, it's you like need a to city. Go to sleep soon it's like a, it's like a, it's like the vatican city right it's like vatican city not literally no. but it's yeah, just like, like a city within more. like a city i Wait, don't know I'm talking about an angels and demons vatican city is a country the illuminati we have you ever been to another airport before i thought it was a city is o'hare your first airport period what is O'Hare the first airport you've been to, period? Yeah, well, I've been oh, to dude, you airport. Because the, uh, this is all airports. It's just a big building with That's a bunch of stuff true. in it. No, no, no. One of the biggest airports in the country. Yeah, we, La- La- LaGuardia sucks. Maybe it's just one. that I've only been to big airports then because I maybe. feel like every airport I've ever been to has been like... Maybe it's not as big as O'Hare, but it's hey, like it's just it's I want a backtrack. big building. With a, does not it's like suck. a mall. It's actually to me, it's pretty like awesome a mall looking. Planes. But it's just not big hub like O'Hare. Best airport, and I've been to... Midway, I've out. been to O'Hare, I've been to you don't Los have to list Angeles, them. Just give I've been to San Diego, I've oh been to Honolulu. San Diego, by far, is the cleanest and best airport that I've ever been to. Surprise, surprise, Sick. it's in California. Oh, Cal- Honolulu California. was pretty nice, too. Cause it, it had, had kind of like a 19th... Did they give you a lay when you come in today? No, no, I, I, you have to pay for that special. That sucks. That's bullshit. Yeah. We're going to the Denver and airport next through, weekend. Uh, and do they give you a free I'm pretty sure there's Illuminati and KKK and aliens there, so that's pretty cool. You looked up all the theories at work? Cat did, and then she tried to explain them to me. There's a lot of theories, weird stuff about with, the Denver, with the Denver Inter- International Airport. 
It's like <gasps> Oh that. Oh, the murals. There's like there's like um the symbols in the ground that they say are like mean something, but I guess it's just like some old Indian language or something. And then there's like this plaque that um the stone like the stone masons or whatever like the freemasons like built the airport and then they put the stone in there and so then like people say it's like an illuminati the uh thing. what was it called the something stone the bloodline of jesus christ rests at the denver international yeah. airport reminds me of that scene in uh, last crusade <laughs> just cut to that scene in last crusade go ahead reminds me of that scene in last crusade when he's in the airport and he sees all this stuff on the floor like someone's gonna oh. climb up really high into the that wasn't an airport that wasn't a it was it was a, a library. library. That's what I said. Library. Didn't I say that? And he said no, yeah. but we got it. Oh, we know okay. what you're talking about. We've all seen it. Someone's going to climb high in the airport. Have you not see, seen it? Wait a minute. The symbols. Last Crusade is the one with Sean Connery as his dad. No, I haven't seen that one. We're named oh, a dog. Cool <laughs> <laughs> I've only seen Let it go, first. Junior. <laughs> but that's your name, isn't it? <laughs> Henry Jones Jr. Temple, yeah. Temple of Doom. Uh, we meet, uh, what's his name? Who's that little, um, little boy in Temple of Doom? Short stack. Short round. Short round. Dance routine. Yes. Yes. Yeah. That's the worst of the th of the four, in my opinion. Oh, not the worst of the four. The worst of the original. I suddenly three. remembered my Charlemagne. Number, th number three, I'd say. Let my friends be the rocks and the trees and the, and the birds, birds in the, the sky. sky. It tells me that goose stepping morons <laughs> such as yourselves should try reading books <laughs> instead of burning them. Ah, <laughs> oh, Sean, he just turned eighty-five recently. He's still alive. Wow. Yeah, eighty-five. That guy'll never die. He's got like a dragon heart or something. Well, that's not true. I mean, he's gonna die someday. You want to put money on it? No. Th th <laughs> <laughs> Think about that for a second. When they filmed The Last Crusade, uh, Sean Connery is only 12 years older than Harrison Ford. Whoa. That's crazy. He's playing his dad. That's wild. So that's how young Harrison Ford looks. And that's how old Sean Connery has he always looked. He still looks great. Sense. Come on, give him some credit. He that looks guy. He's okay for his age. He's 73. That for guy what it's like worth, <laughs> when I Googled old guys trying to look cool, Harrison Ford showed up twice in the Isn't first two. Why did you look that up? Because when uh, when we were talking about when I was talking about how Harrison Ford shouldn't be on Star Wars, and I was like, you know what? Let me just Google cool guys, old, old really old guys trying to look cool and link that to Harrison Ford as a joke. But then he showed up like three times in the results. He's great. He's so a great guy. I, don't I think love he him. Tries. He's a great guy. I think he is my cool. favorite actor. Yeah. I idolize that actor as far as acting is concerned. Why you can't don't you don't idolize anything else? Like, like he's got. A, he I don't know actually, what his political good standpoint dude. is, but I, I know like a lot of his early stuff. I just don't like any of his more recent stuff. He just seems like some guy that's just kind of. What's he done recently? He did, he, uh, he did that one where he was like a news reporter or something like that in a newsroom. Oh, he did Ender's Game. It it's like a lot of his more recent stuff has just been him reading lines. He did uh, the Jackie oh. Robinson story. What's that one where yeah. they were like a morning talk show hosts? Yeah, yeah, that's what I think I'm thinking of. But he also did yeah. Ender's Game where he was just kind of. There he did Anchorman too. Yeah, he was also yeah. On, yeah, as a cameo know. kind of thing. Yeah, get off my plane. Like he could prove me wrong with this <laughs> if he's given good material in the Star Wars movie and he knocks it out of the park. I'll, I'll eat all these words back. But just his more recent stuff, ever since he's like gotten noticeably old, I just haven't liked him. I didn't kill my wife. I can't know. My voice is going now. Yeah. You hear that? It's going. It's all that hey. New York accent you did. What, dude? I don't want to talk right now. All right. I love you, Dave. Sorry, I'm losing it. So are we going to take a smoke break real quick? <laughs> where, oh, where can my Jordan be? He's in the bathroom counting his change. He's wearing number 19 on his hoodie. <laughs> 